Ooh, Elise Starseeker. Lead Explorer, when you upgrade Bob's Tavern, get a recruitment map. Sure. Ha, <laughs> this guy's toast. This incentivizes pushing tavern levels, right? All right, chat, make your bet now. Is Elise power super good or super bad? Super good? Super bad. Super good. Super bad. Double vulgar homunculus. I kind of wish I had a token here. Homunculus is fine level one, but you want a token unit just so that you can sell it later to buy um, two minions on round three. But because you, because I only got one unit instead of two units, this kind of messes up our plan. What does the map do? For three mana, you get to discover a minion. So instead of just buying a specific minion you want, you get to choose from three options. Nice work out there. Keep up the pressure. All right, recruitment map. So yeah, three gold, discover a minion. It's not terrible, right? Is it? I think it really matters what tier you're on. Because if you use this on tier 5, your chances of hitting Light Fang is like really high. Early game, the minions don't matter enough for this to be worth it. But if you're going to buy a minion anyway, it's like, why not, right? Why not? Why not? Oh, there's a Rat King player in the game. That's always really... Oh, MLJM! God, having to reroll this sucks, but I can sell this and discover and hope for something better than a vulgar homunculus. Like a second amalgam! Oh, baby. Oh, baby, baby. Double amalgam. Now we just need a light fang and we're chilling. Chilling and killing. <laughs> yeah, that's a tight game. Uh, we just take two units here, I think. You want this for sure. But who here is better? This is a 4-4, four four, but this is potentially a 6-2. A uh, this is buffable. And this is buffable. What do you guys think? Options, options, options. The 2 1. Mm. They're all kind of, you know, come see, come sa. You know, come see, come sa. I'm gonna go with Rat Pack because I feel like it's more build aroundable. Okay, I hit the Divine Shield, so that's nice. Wow, these are really good trades for me. Thank you, RNG. RNG, what a pal. What a pal. Alright, these all suck, but luckily I can use the three extra gold on my recruitment map. Uh, Psychotron's not bad. Three, like a 3-4 Divine Shield, but Replicating Menace is also... Does it eat up a board space? What do you guys think? Like, Psychotron is good as a unit, but Menace doesn't eat up space. So probably Menace most times here, right? Dennis the Menace. If you go Rat... Like, the problem with going Mech right now is that they nerf Junk Bot. It's a 5 cost unit instead of a 4 cost unit. Murlocs is super poppin'. I still say Mech is the strongest, it's just harder to get going. My hero power really incentivizes me to um, push levels. Oh, these rats attack the worst possible options. Ah, oh, he could have attacked the left one for one more damage. My RNG is the worst. Oh, did you find your shiny Ulu? Nope, did not. And I don't want to talk about it. The hyena is like not trash. 
I'm against Georgie Porgy here. I think next turn this is gonna cost six. I'll have eight mana, so do I want a hyena? It gets sniped. That's what I would have picked. Not a huge fan of hyena. Oh, this guy though. This guy's fucking poggers. Pogares. I'm gonna freeze this just because this is kind of juicy. But Cobalt Guardian is a great pickup for us. Oh, he got so juggler, and he sniped it. I might lose this fight. He's so juggler with the M gang boss is kind of scary. Snipe it! Snipe it! Snipe it! Snippy! Snipey! Ah, I win this. No, actually, I tie this potentially. Yeah, tie. I had a 50% chance to win, 50% chance to tie. Uh, I think we buy the buffer here. It hits four minions, which is pretty good. The Hellmaster is a plus two, plus two. This is a plus eight, plus zero. I'll be Metal Tooth Leaper. Get some power going. We can sell this, we can sell this, we can sell this. Lots of sellable stuff. This gives me a random four cost unit. I want a random five cost unit because it can potentially be like Fang Enforcer and baby. That's hot. That's ooh, 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 that's hot. That's hot. Secret most likely ice block. Oh man, what a waste of the divine shield. Oh that was not a good snipe. That was not good because it's still alive. Okay. Oh, that's a good snipe. Good job, little Murloc. Oh, good snipes, good snipes. And he didn't get his. Uh, this is going to be a tie, right? Because he also has a me replicating menace. Yeah, we'll take a tie. Because uh, we're pushing levels right now. Ooh, Hydra and Replicating Menace. It's hard to say no to that right now. Those are very powerful. Very, very powerful. Very powerful. That's what I would have picked. Hmm. Menagerie Magician is probably the pick here. This is really good. We sell the Rat Pack. We sell this. We buy this. We play it. Go for uh, a buff on the amalgam because it's definitely the minion we're gonna keep. And then we buy this, might as well. Oh, it's a plus two, plus two. This buffs all these bad boys. This buffs all these bad, two bad boys. Uh, we w definitely want the Metal Tooth Leaper. Next turn, this is level seven. This costs seven. We have three mana left over to recruit. Five cost unit. Potentially hit a brand bronze beard. A brand of bronze beard. Or maybe um Life Fang. That's our two options. Oh Brani Bronze Beard. This guy lost to George. So that's good. We're at the same level, so our power level should be about stay on top. equal. Ah, he's going for a beast build. Um, I don't think his rats is gonna be his hyena is gonna be that big because he's not spawning enough rats. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This actually adds more units on the board. No, it's the same. Ooh, look at that damage. So we want Brand Bronze Beard or Life Fang Enforcer. Ideally Life Fang Enforcer because that is super strong. <laughs> oh, and I get it. Someone <laughs> needs to stop me. Because I'm doing real well right now. Uh, this guy is replaceable. Not right now. Actually, maybe right now because it's going to eat up my good buffs. And yeah, we don't want that, right? We do have four buff targets. No, 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 no. We're gonna hit this, 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 and this. It's gonna buff four unit, all of which is pretty delicious. 
question is, do I want this Metal Tooth Leaper? It's only doing a triple buff. Probably not worth the weight, especially at five cost. Dude, this hero power, this hero power is kind of bonkers. Being able to select from three minions off the same tavern tier. Like, yeah, you might get unlucky, but at five, it's like you're either hitting Bran or you're hitting um, Life Fang Enforcer most of the time. You know, RNG is a cruel mistress. Five costs is the best tavern level just because you can hit. Oh, God. Ooh, he hit. Like, I'm glad we killed the poisonous, but I'm also sad we lost the uh, swipe. Even if he beats me, it's okay because my Light Fang enforces skills way better than his crappy ass crap team. I'm sorry, you have to be me. Oh, these are good trades. Okay, yeah, these are good trades. Yeah, it's looking really good right now because my Light Fang enforcer is just gonna get better and better. Ooh, ooh. Carrot boy, Hydra boy. I don't know if I want a Hydra boy. I'm more interested in buff units, right? This is a plus three, plus three, I guess. This is a plus two, plus two. This is a plus two, plus two. Right now, I have four carry units and three, like, whatever units. Plus two, plus two. This is plus two, plus two. No Hydra. Uh, I don't like buying Hydra just because the level up isn't as worth it. I know I can triple it, but it's just a plus two, plus four. I don't know if it's worth it to spend six gold on a plus two, plus four. Yes, I can discover... A six cost, but there's not too much great six cost. There's a couple though. I wouldn't mind it. I just don't know if it's like good, good right now. Mm. Eh. This isn't bad, just because it can potentially give divine shield to my Cobalt Guardian. Right now, I got three buff slots here, right? This guy's always being stayed, so, like, ideally, I hit a brand, it would be really good for us. Hit a brand. Oh, man, I'm gonna crush this guy. He's definitely, like, supremely omega lead dead. Hey, Lee Spiel's kind of busted. Uh, I guess this is takeable for now. I'm not sure. This will buff two units. This is a zero four, right? I don't know if it's worth it. Eh, it's health buff. I'm really looking for a brand though. Rival Finn could be potentially interesting. Toxfin is always appreciated. Eh, collides here. Ooh, maybe I can ro roll another collide here here. Uh, do I want to play the Colite Seer now? I did beat the hell out of Bob earlier. I'll put the rover right after the Guardian. So friendly is horrible. Yeah, one gold for plus one plus one. Instead of refreshing your entire... I'm looking at Goldrin here. Nah. Instead of re refreshing your entire tavern, you go for a plus one plus one. I don't know. Like, that could be worth it. No, that can't be worth it, right? Eh, oh no. You should be refreshing for plus one plus ones. Not sure. Right now, what I want to do is hit those uh, annoyal modules to give divine shield to my unit. I can't believe I have not seen them. Oh lord! Double poisonous with double divine shield. That is hella scary. And 31 health, too. Okay, I lose this. 
Those are some really healthy amalgam with divine shield and poisonous. That brand bronze beard, he allowed so much um, double buffing. Did the oh, that was the worst case. That was the target that killed nothing. Oh, this is bad. Ooh, he's at one health. God, he was so close to being knocked out. I need to find my modules. This one's not terrible. We can give um, buffs to the right units. There's a brand here. I think it's okay to have the brand for now. Do I want to give this taunt? I feel like I do. It might seem controversial, chat. It's like, why are you giving that taunt? But trust old Toasty Boy. He always has a plan. I'm gonna buy this for now, just for the plus two, plus two. Trust the old toasty boy. That's why I put it all the way on the right, so this swipe target wouldn't be that bad for us. Nice swipe on my part, and my uh, Hydra lives, that's huge. And now, because this guy hits and dies, I get the shield. Ooh, look at this value! I'm not sure if I can beat. Nah, I nah, can't beat him. Would do like a significant amount of damage though. Someone needs to knock that Bartendotron guy out. Hopefully RNG. But he has Divine Shield and Poisonous Amalgams. These are. He's gonna be very scary. I'll take this. Hawksman? Yeah, I'll take the two. Jungle Metal Tooth Leaper is not the worst thing, I suppose. Don't really need that now that I think about it. These are already infinite damage. Plus two, plus two, probably not worth anything. Yeah, I still just am getting carried by four specific units. Uh, it's that amalgam on the right. It's gonna be a real problem. Yeah, that's not terrible. Yeah, this isn't terrible. Is it? Okay, wait, I don't I, I can't kill a 42. Hopefully I can just kill the unit on the left to reduce the damage a little bit. Oh god. I need to find those modules, man. Buying a metal tooth leaper probably wasn't the best idea. He's always surviving with one. He's playing around my Hydra. Playing his rack king here. Like his advantage right now is the fact that he has shield on his amalgams. I don't. A good tactical choice. <gasps> Hopefully this guy's not too strong. Having the Noimage is gonna help, assuming I don't die here. He also has brand and poisonous. Wait, this guy has double amalgam, double poisonous too. Are they the same person?
Break the shield, please break the shield. Nice! Okay, that's big, I think. Do I have enough damage to kill this? Does he have enough damage to kill me? Oh wait, no, I have just enough. No, the bad ordering! Oh, it's a tie, but I could have killed him. I say a lot of these units kind of suck dong. Definitely cannot combine under any circumstances. God, you mean let me fight the clone army? What is this? Ah, oh, just gonna be a close fight. Hits the divine shield with the snipe. And I should put my weaker unit on the left here. Now this time I came prepared with poisonous of my own. But perhaps that's the move. It's fine. I'll lo I probably am gonna lose this, but it's gonna be a tie again. Oh wait, I got divine shield. Actually, I think I win now. Because of the divine shield. Actually, maybe not. Oh, math is freaking hard. How close was I? No, I think he wins. <sighs> okay, I th I don't know if we can keep the light thing or the brand. This was close, but what I need to do is maybe put minions on the left to pop the shield first, and then go for a swipe attack. The swipe's not even gonna do it. He has so much health. Let's go for a recruit, I guess. Zap Slywick. That recruit that does remove the cheeky monkeys on the side. Cause he does have some cheeky monkeys, right? Probably Zap. Yeah, it's gonna remove the weak minions he's using to space out his um, good stuff. That was really good attack. That was a really good attack. I think we win. Yeah, he's out of poisonous. We win. And it's lethal for sure. We got the zap, and if he snipes the side minions, and then maybe if we put another weak ass minion in front, it could work. We know he has Hydra. This isn't bad at this point. Ran. This is probably usable. Toxfin. Gentle Megasaur is really good, right? I can potentially give Divine Shield to one of my guys. Uh, health, I guess. The frozen winds guide me. Now, my next so I'm gonna do it like this. He's gonna have some kind of swipe attack, I imagine. So Zap Slywick removes the minions in between. This removes the divine shield. There's the minion in between. And then this guy can remove the divine shield. Which leaves the Hydra open to a better attack. Oh, there you go. Survives with 1 HP. Uh, I need to go through 82 health here. Is it doable? I, I think I can do it. I think I do it, right? If this is not the last attack, I do it. Yes! <laughs> oh my! 
Oh. Man, this guy was hanging on with his one HP. <sighs> them points, baby. Let's go. Yeah, that Zap Slywick was um, hecka good. And uh, moving the 4 4 to the left of the Hydra to bunch the shield off first so that um, the Hydra can do max damage. Ooh, I positioned that perfectly. Hey, lights out.